author known for her anti-Islam viewpoints will be speaking at a local Jewish center this weekend. Now, this appearance is causing some controversy. That's right. Christine Ensing is in Great Neck now with that story. Christine? Now, Pamela Geller is scheduled to speak here at the Shabbat of Great Nick this Sunday morning. She and her highly controversial organization, Stop Islamization of America, accepted the invitation here after a synagogue in this very same community told her she was no longer welcome there. We support the civilized man. And I, I can't get these ads up. I got to sue. You know why I have to sue? because I'm insulting the savages, that's why. Known for her anti-Islamic messages, activist Pamela Geller expected to fill the house here at Shabbat of Great Neck on Sunday, where she is scheduled to give one of her controversial speeches. Based on my conversations with her, she's not about hatred, she's not about uh, bigotry, and she will speak about unity, respect, and love of this country and Israel. And, positive things that we all support. The new location for the speech came after the Great Neck Synagogue decided to cancel Geller's appearance there after numerous complaints. In a recent op-ed article in the Jewish Week paper, Rabbis Michael White and Jerome Davidson write, quote, we state unequivocally that Geller's inflammatory rhetoric does not represent us or the great majority of Jews in Great Neck and on Long Island. Hate speech has no place in synagogues. The Anti-Defamation League, as well as the Southern Poverty Law Center, have both classified Geller's group, Stop Islamization of America, as a hate group. Great Neck Synagogue's website states they decided to cancel the speech because of potential security concerns. And on her blog, Geller writes, quote, Two courageous and magnificent rabbis have asked me to speak on Sunday. Both of them are standing up for the freedom of speech and the defense of the Jewish people. The cancellation by the Great Neck Synagogue was particularly craven and cowardly. Now, we did reach out to a, a number of rabbis across Nassau County. Many of them did not want to comment on this controversy. On this controversy. Uh, Geller is scheduled to speak here at 10 a.m. on Sunday. She mentioned that two rabbis had extended invitations to her, the second in Edison, New Jersey, where she'll be speaking Sunday night. We're